Wow, take a look at this awesome Jeep Wrangler. Guess what year it is? Nope, you're wrong. It's not a 2005, you can tell by the square headlights. This is a 1995 model Jeep Wrangler YJ. Unbelievable condition, look at that paint. Sitting on a brand new set of tires, front and rear. Body's nice and straight. Paint's got an awesome shine to it. Interior's nice and clean. It's got a best top. And uh, it's the one right here that latches right into the windshield so you don't have to worry about that channel that some of those older Jeeps had. Where it was really a pain to put it in there, you know what I mean? Really hard. Interior is nice and clean. Look at that. This is just, had some birds uh, grabbing some berries out of that uh, palm tree, so they dirtied up my truck a little bit. Only only sign of wear really in the on the seats is right here on the driver's side, of course, you know, from getting in and out of it over the past 15 years. You can see right there, but it's very minimal. Uh, you know, I wouldn't even... I wouldn't even worry about it. It's Jeep. Take a look at that paint. Look at the reflection in it. Look at these tires. They're brand new. Front and rear. Got a little bend right here in the front bumper. Must have bumped into something. Couldn't have been anything major. There's no damage right there to the front fender. I think something maybe bumped here and then it's got a little something right there. This is a nice, nice Jeep. Got deep, glossy shine. Soft tops in really good condition. It's got the full hard doors with the roll-up glass windows. So if you've got a hard top, uh, you won't have to purchase the doors to go along with it. Dash is in really good shape. You do have a little discoloration. Very minor, right there, and on the grab handle, and there's no cracking. Look at this carpet again, look at that. Look at the seats. But yeah, the soft top doesn't have any tears in it, does not leak. It's in really good shape. My last Jeep sold to the very first person that came to see it. It didn't even make it to eBay. I had it on Craigslist for about two hours. Someone drove out from Tampa to come get it. I sell nice Jeeps and I'm sure that's what's going to happen with this one here too. So don't hesitate. Give me a call quick if you don't want to miss out. I think that's one of those berries from those, up, those uh, birds got... Yeah. There's one of the culprits. Anyway, back to this vehicle. Drives out great. Really smooth on the highway. Starts right up. Very torquey. This is the four cylinder. They're excellent for crawling over rocks and creeping through the mud because they have an outstanding amount of torque. So. Without further ado, let's fire it up. Uh, the uh, only things that I know this Jeep needs at this point in time is that the radio is not hooked up. Uh, so if you know about head units, you could uh, get this one going. Um, there's the uh, antenna will need to be replaced. Let me show you. I like to point out everything I can. So your antenna looks like it. I don't know, someone might have stolen it, broken it and stolen it. Who knows? Or it just broke. Gosh, look at that paint. This thing is amazing. Perfect for a day like today, you know? Driving around with the palm trees, blue sky. Got some clouds for the first time in two weeks. Kind of lets you see just how blue the sky really is. All right. 
Okay, and uh, let's fire it up. So she starts right up. No warning lights on the dash, except for telling me to buckle up. Idle's nice and smooth. For the only other issue that I would address, I would recommend uh, replacing your multifunction switch here. Uh, it operates your head uh, wipers properly. However, uh, to do your blinkers, you've got to actually manually do it. And uh, the dim headlights won't work. You have to put them on brights. So I'm, I'm saying that I believe it's this, this is the culprit here. Pretty easy fix. I could do it. I'm just trying to keep the cost down on this vehicle. Most Jeepers like to do their own repair work. Uh, you can get that stock right there with the internals off of eBay. And it's usually the internals that are bad. Right here, you just pull the steering wheel off and replace those. Uh, usually running about, gosh, I would say they're like 40, 50 bucks, somewhere around there. Look at your oil pressures right where it needs to be. Okay, goes right into four wheel high with no problem. See there, let's put it into low. Very torquey, ooh, yeah, nice. Goes right back with no problem. Okay, now getting it into gear, it's very easy, look at that. Okay, I put my foot in the clutch, watch. First gear, second gear, third. See there, I can do it with my finger, isn't that nice? Clutch is in great shape. So let's get her out on the road. This thing is great to drive. Oh yeah. Oh, nice cool breeze coming. Shifted it, no problem. Brakes feel great also. The suspension's nice and tight. You're gonna love this Jeep. I mean, gosh, get it and ride it around the lake. Take it up into the mountains, go full wheeling, go camping, whatever. This Jeep is in outstanding condition. It's been very well taken care of. Alternator's charging properly. All your uh, gauges are right where they need to be. You will not go wrong with this purchase other than if you fail to contact me and talk about doing a deal on it because I assure you it will not last long. Like I said, my last Wrangler was an 89. Uh, wasn't near as clean as this one and it sold to the first person to come see it This one's the nicest 95 I've seen and I'm, I'm around Jeeps all the time. I buy and sell Jeeps I bought my first Jeep 20 years ago uh, and uh, Know a good bit about them. I know what to look for watch out a little ibis getting in the middle of the road um, But anyway you got any questions about this Jeep or if you want to talk about purchasing it, which I recommend, that's what you do. Give me a call. Gosh, these tires feel good too. It's smooth. Steering feels great. Look, using my pinky again on the steering. Look at there. Very easy to maneuver. See? Uh, give me a call at 863-670-5420. Do not hesitate and miss out on this awesome opportunity to own a Jeep Wrangler YJ in outstanding condition.